Is your debt causing you sleepless nights? Knock your debt out with Debt KO. And your debt won't be the only thing keeping you up at night. Debt KO, free impartial advice on all your debt. This is Coogan Cassis for IFL TV in association with MTK Global at the SEC Arena here. First of all, congratulations, Jack Cullen. Fantastic performance uh, to beat John Doherty. Uh, yeah, what was your assessment of the fight tonight? Yeah, you know, obviously we knew John Doherty was a tough lad, tough sapo lad. And um, like the first round, it, like it, not, it did knock me down, but it was more of a slip of anything. And, you know, it didn't, it didn't, it didn't fade me at all. I got up and shook it off and uh, carried on going. What was your uh, take on the scores tonight? Obviously all in your favour, but uh, a couple of them cards were close. Uh, what was your take on the scores? Yeah, and listen, I knew it was, I knew it was a close fight because obviously he put me down in that first round, so that's a 10-8, and you've got, <laughs> from from the first round getting put down, like, you've got to come back, haven't you? And uh, I feel I do feel like we've done enough, and yeah, it was a great fight, and uh, I'm, I'm pleased with it. Um, we know obviously a lot was said during the build-up to that, but... Um, just reveal to me, obviously, what you said to to Matchroom uh, a minute ago about what he was saying to you. Why you were waiting for those scores to be announced? Yeah, yeah. yeah well, basically, he just said to me, he said, "Listen," he said, "I was just basically kind of egging you on, so you come forward." And obviously, that's how I, that's how I box anyway. I come forward, you know. And I, I feel like he wanted to build up a bit, you know, which is fair enough. There's nothing wrong with nothing wrong with building a fight up. Um, so yeah. Um, obviously, uh, this puts you a step closer to to what you want and uh, shot the. The British title, so uh, that's incoming for 2021. Yeah, yeah, 2021 is going to be a big year for me, mate. And um, like I said, it's time to take over. On Sky Sports, you you know publicly said yeah. a message to to Eddie Hearn, really, isn't it? So if he's watching this now, what is the message to Matchroom and Eddie Hearn? Listen, Eddie, I know you've done loads for me uh, with this lockdown and that, but um, if you say, say, sign me up, I appreciate it. You know, it, um, got a nice family at home. I've got I've got I'm, I'm in a good stable, and. Um, Big fights on Sky Sports, what more do I want? You know, this is my job, um, it's my life. And um, this is what I'm in it for, this is, the, this is what I'm in for, to be on Sky Sports. Are, are you away from the, the Trelly fight now? Is that, if it happens again, it does, if it doesn't? Yeah, listen, if it happens again, it happens. But you know what I mean? Like I said um, in the last interview, I'm, I'm moving on from Zach Trelly. Um, I felt like I beat him on that fight as well. And uh, you know, yeah, he, he just he just he just won that ultimate boxer, but that, there was no one really in it. You know, um, I'm looking past that, Charlie. I, I'm, I'm like I said, I want to I want to do bigger and better. I do just want to bring Mike in. Come in. It's a team sport at times. Not in the ring on the night. Yeah, the other team members. Get him in. Get him in. Just crowd him in. Crowd him in. Uh, let's try and get you all in the shot there. There's the shot, so if you all just like move in where it's at. There we go, there we go. There we go, there we go. There we go. Um, yeah, what was your assessment of that fight tonight? Yeah, no, Jack pushed him back at range. I thought he was uh, in a bit of trouble sometimes. Obviously he got dropped with that daft shot. I think he was more off balance than anything. Um, when he put the kid under pressure, let his shots go, he was catching him and hurting him as well a good few times. So yeah, it was made up with Jack. He's not been with us that long. We've worked with him before his last fight, but not as the full trainers. This time he's come with us, and I just think it could be a lot better. We can improve him a lot more as well. Is that your phone ringing? Yeah, sorry, <laughs> uh, yeah same question to you, really. I'll, I'll pass you the mic. Yeah. Well, I just think he was landing with a cleaner work as well, and more of it as well. Like I say, bit of a bit of a dodgy start, but uh, as he grew into the fight, finding his range. And then the last two rounds, I don't think the kid wanted it, to be honest with you. So. Uh, just down, bite down on that gum shield, and uh, yeah, the better man won it. Uh, open message out to Matchroom and Eddie Hearn, sign me up because obviously performances like that aren't are to be ignored. Yeah, definitely. I mean, every time Jack fights on Sky, he puts a good fight up, doesn't he? No matter whether it's a win, lose, or whatever. Sign tonight, up, Ted. yeah, tonight he sign came, up, you know, Ted. he came and uh, <laughs> done, the on. done the business <laughs> against the unbeaten prospect. So yeah, why not sign him up if the other kids sign up? Get Jack signed up. He can sell tickets and he puts on exciting fights. Absolutely. Uh, final word from you, Jack. Have you got anything else you want to add before uh, before we finish? Um, no, I'm just, you know, I'm grateful and I can't thank these two enough for uh, what they've done. They've took me on, and uh, I know it's been short notice, but. 
I'm going to get back in the gym soon and we're going to carry on working and working on stuff what they want me to work on and you know you're going to see a bigger and better Jack Cullen. Obviously Kerry Case isn't here but obviously uh, yeah, I uh, want to thank uh, Kerry yeah. as well. Uh, yeah I just want to thank Kerry he's a star wart in North West Boxing and uh, yeah he's been a great cutsman as well so thanks a lot Kerry. Lovely boys congratulations and uh, I'll let you get back to the changing room all right thank you. <laughs> Is your debt causing you sleepless nights? Knock your debt out with Debt KO. And your debt won't be the only thing keeping you up at night. Debt KO. Free, impartial advice on all your debt.